This is a story about partnership, about teamwork, about sharing resources across borders. It's also a story about energy, about innovation, about technical cooperation between countries. But most of all, it's a story about neighbors working together to create a remarkable achievement. The Sarawak West Kalimantan 275 kilovolt interconnection project. The interconnection began with an idea raised in a meeting of Hapua, the heads of ASEAN Power Utilities Authorities. It rapidly grew to become a flagship project to be implemented according to the BIMP Iaga spirit of economic cooperation. The success of this interconnection is actually due to the strong state leadership on both sides and the close working teams between Ministry of Utilities and Sarawak Energy with our Indonesian counterparts. This interconnection recognized as one of the important flagship projects under BMEGA will provide for cross-border social economic development that will mutually benefit both sides. And uh, it also adds to our credential as a major power provider, signifying the first step of state aspiration to be the powerhouse in the ASEAN region. Pertama-tama, saya mengucapkan selamat atas terkeinterkoneksian wilayah Kalimantan Barat maupun Sarawak dengan transmisi 275 kV. Diharapkan interkoneksi ini akan mendukung pertumbuhan ekonomi baik di Kalimantan Barat maupun Sarawak. Dan ini merupakan implementasi dari komitmen bersama antara Malaysia dan Indonesia dalam melakukan apa yang disebut dengan ASEAN Power Grid. The project is one of the most significant milestones towards realizing the ASEAN Power Grid an initiative by the Association of Southeast Asian Nations to strengthen electricity infrastructure in the region, especially in areas where economic development is uneven. The reasons for the project's significance are threefold. Firstly, it is West Kalimantan's and Sarawak's first cross-border interconnection, bringing us one step closer to a transnational Borneo grid. Secondly, it is the first ASEAN power grid interconnection outside the Asian mainland. Peninsula Malaysia already has interconnections to Thailand and Singapore. Finally, it was agreed and implemented in record time due to close interregional cooperation in the spirit of BIMP Iaga. But this begs the question, why was it needed at all? West Kalimantan is one of Indonesia's fastest growing provinces, but requires more electricity to power its fast track socio economic development. Sarawak has the capacity to export electricity thanks to its massive investment in renewable hydropower to drive the SCORE development strategy, the Sarawak Corridor of Renewable Energy. The interconnection from Sarawak supplies part of the West Kalimantan grid, which covers 2,374,128 people, or 49.57% of the province population. In the short term, this fully satisfies current demand, allowing PLN to optimize its future generation plan for West Kalimantan. In the longer term, it allows West Kalimantan to develop more economic options for its future needs and to share its capacity with Sarawak in future. Eventually, electricity will flow in both directions and through the synergy created, the partners will have access to a larger and stronger power generation and transmission system. The increased resilience of interconnected networks will provide both Sarawak and West Kalimantan with reserve capacity and greater energy security. The benefits were obvious to both partners and events moved rapidly. After productive negotiations between Sarawak Energy, PTPLN and the Asian Development Bank, a power exchange agreement between Sarawak Energy and PTPLN was signed on September 5, 2012. A joint technical committee was immediately set up to expedite the process of power exchange and only four months later, in January 2013, construction work began. 
The physical infrastructure would be constructed jointly by Sarawak Energy and PTPLN. A 275 kilovolt double circuit transmission line, initially carrying 230 megawatts, upgradable to 500 megawatts, would run from Mambong, Sarawak to Bengkayang in West Kalimantan. Sarawak Energy was tasked with the 45.6 km connection from the existing Mambong substation to the international border, including 144 transmission towers. PTPLN was responsible for the longer 82.6 km section from the border to Bengkaya, which required the construction of 201 transmission towers and a 275 to 150 kV substation. We have come a long way from the past studies that were carried out to assess the feasibility and benefit of connecting the power system of Sarawak and West Kalimantan. The importance of the project is in the improvement in the reliability of electricity supply in West Kalimantan and reduction in the reliance on existing and proposed power generation based on fossil fuel sources. Besides supplying energy, and reducing the cost to West Kalimantan, the interconnection also promotes energy security for both states as it serves as another source of supply, especially during emergencies. 275 kilovolts was selected as the standard voltage as it was suitable for use by both partners and offered sufficient capacity for the future. Sarawak's portion was undertaken and financed internally by Sarawak Energy, while Indonesia built its own portion with ADB funding. While there were challenges to overcome, including agreement on how to adapt differences in technical and operational standards, the Joint Technical Committee worked effectively and dealt with any potential problems as soon as they arose. This first Bidyaga cross-country interconnection where differences in respective countries' regulatory framework, design criteria and operational regimes provides requirements for harmonization that will also facilitate other potential interconnections within BIM Yaga. There are also working cultural differences among the two sides, where during the implementation of the project, both sides are working very hard to to tolerate and uh, resolve these differences. Because you know Semenanjung and Sumatra hasn't been interconnected yet, but this one, this is the fastest interconnection. Uh, I'm very proud of all of it. Thanks to this close cooperation, construction proceeded rapidly and the physical infrastructure was completed before the end of 2015. Then, just a few weeks later, after intensive testing and commissioning work, the first Mambong Bengkayang circuit was successfully energized and synchronized on January 20, 2016. Power began to flow between the electrical grids of the two countries for the very first time. Pada Januari 2016, interkoneksi mulai dilakukan dan pada saat itu uh, mulai tidak terjadi pemadaman dan beban puncak yang terjadi hingga bulan Juni 2017 ini sudah mencapai 306 MW dan kapasitas naik menjadi 360 MW. Dengan interkoneksi ini maka fuel mix yang tadinya 98% sekarang menjadi 68%. Since its successful commissioning, the project has delivered up to 150 megawatts of electricity to West Kalimantan. This will almost double to 230 megawatts with the completion of Sarawak's 500 kilovolt backbone and PTPLN's transmission reinforcements. The benefits for West Kalimantan and Sarawak have been immediate. Brownouts and load curtailment have been virtually eliminated. 
so PTPLN's domestic customers can enjoy reliable supply in their own homes. PTPLN's business customers can plan for increased productivity, growth and expansion. The interconnection of uh, this electricity from uh, Malaysia and Indonesia actually it benefits us where we don't use uh, a lot of fossil fuel already. It means that we lessen the, the, use, the usage of our fossil fuel. And safety critical public services can function smoothly with reliable power. Dibandingkan tahun 2014-2015, supply listrik saat ini jauh lebih baik. The economic benefits of expanding the ASEAN power grid are every bit as important as the impact on consumers. West Kalimantan, which relies on imported fuels for power generation, could save more than 75 million US dollars annually in fuel costs until it fully develops its own energy resources. And as the energy supplied by Sarawak is mainly generated from clean and renewable resources, West Kalimantan can cut fossil fuel use and significantly reduce its carbon footprint. It has always been the state vision to achieve an interconnected uh, Borneo grid. And uh, of course the project success gives us the reassurance that we have what it takes to pursue regional partnership in uh, energy development. I note that this technically well-executed interconnection project also depended on mutual trust and respect, resulting in a good working relationship. I'm grateful to our Indonesian counterparts uh, for their partnership and cooperation in this. The benefits for Sarawak are equally tangible. In the long term, the interconnection will provide strong support to Sarawak's southern network system, which lies between West Kalimantan and our northern power plants. While in the medium term, as West Kalimantan develops its own energy resources and potentially links up with Indonesia's other four Borneo provinces, Sarawak's energy security is enhanced through access to additional generating capacity and the interconnection with ASEAN. In addition, increasing prosperity and economic growth in West Kalimantan will provide valuable opportunities for cross-border trade. This interconnection project reflects the uh, cordial partnership between both organizations over the years, as well as the dedication of both teams uh, towards achieving a common goal of energy security, lower carbon emissions and optimal costs. BIMP IAGA's defining characteristic is the strong partnership between the private and public sectors, with each playing a clearly defined role to benefit the member countries. The interconnection project truly embodies the spirit of cooperation and self-help. And ASEAN, benefiting from this first transmission interconnection in Borneo and the valuable experiences gained, sees its dream of a regional power grid take another important step towards realization. I'm very grateful, I'm very happy, and I'm very proud. Yeah. I, uh, I can tell you how I feel. Uh, when we do the first interconnection in January 20, yeah, you can see, if you see the video, yeah, we, uh, what we, uh, we, we, we just say, hooray. <laughs> Together, under the spirit of being Ega, let us achieve more in partnership with our neighbours in Borneo. Congratulations to Sarawak Energy and PLN for successfully implementing the 275 KV line. Untuk rakan-rakan sekerja saya di PLN, saya ucapkan ribuan terima kasih kepada anda semua atas kerjasama anda dalam menjayakan projek interkoneksi Sarawak West Kalimantan yang merupakan peristiwa penting untuk kedua-dua negara ini. Congratulations and thank you to both Sarawak Energy and PLN teams for this very significant accomplishment. Good job. Well done. Congratulations!